welcome to mule bite series presented by mule soft center of excellence team at royal cyber today i'm going to show you how to import email attachments via imap email connector in mule 4 here is a quick look at our agenda i'll show you how to receive emails from the mail server via imap how to process the email payload send an email acknowledgement back to the sender and a quick look at the email connector configuration and the configuration of imap access in the mail server now finally the demo here is a quick look at the api as soon as the email is received the api captures the email address of the sender it also looks at the email body for any attachments as soon as an attachment is found it processes the file in our case it converts the xml file to a json format writes it to our local file storage finally sends an acknowledgement back to the sender and here is a quick look at the imap configuration first in the anypoint studio here is a configuration for the email imap connector Enter the host name of your server, mail server here in the host name field and enter the user ID of the mailbox in the user ID field and the password in the password field. And under the basic settings, mention the name of the folder which is being monitored, which is supposed to be monitored and some filters to exclude emails which have already been processed. An additional filter to only look emails with specific subject. In my case, it's order updates. And we are monitoring the uh, mail server, we are polling the mail server every three seconds. And here is the configuration of IMAP in the mail server. In our case, it's Gmail. Just go to settings. Under settings, click this forwarding and pop slash IMAP menu. If you scroll down a little bit, you will see this IMAP access section. Click enable IMAP radio button to enable IMAP access to your Mule API. That is it. All right, time for some quick action. So here is the API. I have deployed this API on my local machine. It is running. Let's send an email and see how it works. So I have this email ready. I've attached an XML file to this. I'm sending an email to royalcyber.demo at gmail.com and the subject is order updates. Send. Let's go to the mailbox and see what happens. So we have received the email in my demo folder. Now refresh. So the email has been processed. It has changed the status from unread to read status. Okay, and I've also received an acknowledgement from the API, which is my file has been successfully processed. Let's look at our mailbox. Okay, so here is the email I've received from the API. It says the file order.xml has been successfully processed. Please find the processed file attached. Okay, it has also attached the process file, which is in JSON format now. <clears throat> and here is a quick look at the send component here. We are mentioning the from address of the mail server being monitored for the purpose of the demo. And the captured email address is being set to the to address field. And in the body, we are typing the email content. And in the attachment, we are attaching the process payload. That is it. We have come to the end of the demo session. Thank you for watching this episode of Mule Bytes. Please hit bell icon to subscribe to the channel and get more such exciting videos. You can also leave a comment with topics you would like to see in future episode episodes. Until then, stay tuned.